Hey, what's up everyone? Bob Kings here and welcome to some Darwin Project. So this is a game on Steam. It's an open beta at the moment. I think it's going to be an open beta over the weekend. Hey, Bubble Kings, you truly are the king of bubbles. I'll oh, beat the shit out of you. Good job, good job. Thanks. <laughs> um, <laughs> Jesus Christ. What a way to do the intro. Um, Yeah, so <laughs> this is a uh, Hunger Games style game similar to like PUBG and Fortnite, but it's a much more about the uh, survivability aspect and gathering and it stays much more true to like the actual Hunger Game sh uh, movie if you watch that. So the person who was just talking is the director. Um, you see in the um, top right there's Deadly Panda. However, that's the director. Um, the person flies around in a little ship and oh shit we oh we got a reach chest okay. Um, yeah, they fly around a little ship and they sort of act like the director in the Hunger Games, if you've seen that. They can give, like, special items to people, um, if they're doing, like, really badly, or if they do stuff that the director wants them to do. Or if they're just making the match more entertaining, sort of thing. Um, for example, if you're, like, really low on arrows, they can give you extra arrows, or if you're, uh, really low on your heat, they can increase your temperature, which is nice. Um, this is one of the things they can actually do is summon these hey, electronics. Hey, cheers. Is anyone <laughs> else around here? Um, wait. No, nah, not in your area. Oh, sweet. Cheers. Okay, so the director can spawn in these, um, electronics, which are basically like your high end resource. Um, and they let you get these super strong upgrades here. So we're actually going to get a turret which we can use, which is really nice. Um, that was really nice of the director. Uh, but we need to get back to finding more resources because we need to upgrade our gear and like our clothes and stuff so we can actually survive in this weather. So you can see where the minimap is down here. There's this blue bar. This is our temperature. If that drops to zero, we pretty much die. So we need to build like clothes and stuff so we don't um, drop in temperature as quickly. And we also have to build fires. But the problem with building a fire is that it creates smoke and light. And that gives away your position a bit because people can see it. So we have to be a bit careful to um, not give away our position when we're trying to heat ourselves up. Okay, I'm going to actually build a turret up here. Just so, if anyone comes through, the turret will try and get some damage on them. Now, the turrets aren't too strong, but they're good to, um, you know, poke them a bit, get a bit of damage on them, and let you know that someone's coming towards you, so. They can be quite useful. Uh, we're getting a couple of items here. I actually want to build some. I'm going to get some cloaks, so I don't lose my temperature as quickly, because we are actually quite low on temperature already. Um, someone's launching a nuke into our area, which is not nice. So we need to get out of it. I'm sorry, little shit. You escaped my dudes. Oh man, this is not good. Yeah, so another player, I think, dropped a uh, nuke in this area. And, <laughs> Jesus Christ, this director. I think at least I'm on their good side, so they're not gonna try and get me killed. Which is good. Oh man, um, let's get out of this nuke. Oh, okay, sweet, we're out. Okay, there's six players left. We haven't found anyone yet. Which can be, uh, a real. It can be good because then we, um, can get all these resources. But it can be bad because it means that they could also be getting even more. Because when you kill people, you get whatever they, like, had, any resources they had, so. Killing people can be sometimes a much more efficient way to, uh, get. Oh, shit, I am actually freezing to death. I need to build a fire. So your screen actually freezes up when you're getting cold. So, you can actually tell. Um, I'm going to build another fur cloak, so we won't have to build as many fires later on. Oh my god, you serious? Okay. Oh, this center zone's are going to be a forbidden zone, so we have to get out of this one. Um, which kind of sucks. I guess we can go back to our previous one, because the nuke is now gone. If we want to. But I might go down towards the electric um, 
the electronics down here so we can get another upgrade. Because these upgrades are super powerful. But the next one I really want to get is my G one, which is this camo upgrade, which allows us to become transparent for a short period of time. This is really good because if you get jumped on, you can always just go invisible. Or oh, someone else is going to get it. But you can always just go invisible and then um, either kill them or like disengage if you're in a bad position. Um, shit, we can't actually get over from here, which is really bad. We're going to have to run around. Luckily, we don't die instantly. So, these are sort of like the blue zones you get in PUBG and um, Fortnite. Oh, we're getting tracked now, though. Oh, man, I'm in a bit of trouble. So, sometimes you can get tracked if someone finds your resources that you've previously um, taken. I don't know how we're getting tracked. I don't know. Someone somehow found something. Must have been something we built. It must be in the top left here. Something we built up there. Or something like that. Um, they can actually track you for a bit. Like, we can use this. Someone's taken some wood off this. We can use to sort of track someone's position for a bit. So, someone's all the way over there. It's useful if we want to try and find him and kill him. Um, but he's quite far away. So, I think we'll just continue gathering some resources. We need to upgrade our weapon. So, we've got two types of weapons. We've got this axe here, which we can use. And we also got our bow. <laughs> this commentary. Oh, okay. So, what's up? Are they still really far away from me? I can't find anyone. I think they're really far away still. I'm gonna try and get information out of her. Uh, let's see. Oh, this. Oh shit. Okay, so the man hunts on someone. Oh, it's a manhole on the person right next to me. Okay, she, I think she, she might have tried to um give away the location of someone that was chasing me, so I could actually notice someone coming towards me. A new electronic is available. I'm actually. Bob, go fight gods. You can, you can't beat the shell. Yep, I'm on it. Okay, we're getting tracked still, which is bad because someone could come up behind us, which is why I'm a bit worried. Um, I want to get this upgrade first, though. Let's get some upgrades, then we can go actually go after him and maybe take him out. What a director. Okay. Oh, we didn't actually finish that upgrade, did we? We moved too early. Okay. So, the director can put manhunts on people, and usually they give you good stuff if you kill them, so... Easy, quite. Oh, someone's fighting him. Okay. Might be a lot of action over here. He's on the other side of the hill. There's no fall damage, which is nice. We don't have to worry. Um, oh man, that guy seems to be destroying people, though. Let's see if we can get over there. Some arrows on the floor from them fighting. That's nice. We can see them walking. Oh, bubbles. Bubbles. Where is, where is he? A new electronic is available. Yeah, I think he's down the bottom here. We can still see this guy. Oh shit. Oh, the electronics. Wait, wait. Oh, should we just fight this guy? I think I want to fight this guy. Before he gets this one. I don't know if we can get to him before he gets to it though. Oh man. Let's try and use our speed potion thing here to try and get there quicker. Oh, he's got invulnerability. Oh shit, okay. Wait, let's try and get over to him before he finishes that. Okay, we knocked him off it. But we didn't get any damage because he was invulnerable during it. Oh shit, okay. Wait, maybe we can bait him over towards us. Oh, okay, he shot us so we got knocked away. Well, we are in for a battle. Let's get a turret set up here. Try and bane him up here. Holy crap. Where is he? Come out. Where are you? Oh, right, there he is. We've got one person. 
Where's he going? He's gonna knock back over this way. We'll take this person out first, I think. Oh shit. Holy shit. Oh, we're taking a bit oh, of damage. You guys don't need me anymore. We are taking a bit of damage. Yeah. I'm gonna put a rat um rig trap down here so someone might open it. Where is he? I saw some guy here. Where'd he go? Taking a bit of damage. This is not nice. Can't see his footprints. Oh, here we go. One person around this way. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, shit. That guy is going to kill us. Okay, I got a turret set up. Oh, she destroyed the turret. Oh, man. He's going vulnerability. That's not good. Okay, I need to run, I think. Because otherwise, I'm going to die here. Because I'm way too low on life. Northeast zone is about to be forbidden. I don't know if this guy's going to chase us. He might. We can find out. Let's try and work our way back, I think. We still do the electronic in the middle we want. Oh, that gravity did help us so much, so I think we would have died. It was running straight for us. If we didn't have any arrows left, then I might have been able to, um,. Can we get up here? No, we can't. Healing oh no, we need healing. Okay, let's get up here. I'm gonna try and get into like one of the far corners or something so I can place down. Oh, we don't have any wood shit. We need to get some wood. Because otherwise, we're gonna freeze to death soon. Okay. I mean, that's our fake trap we placed down, so let's not go into that. Let's get back up here real quick. We'll try and scare some people off. Okay, so we we'll place that down. We we'll place our fire down. And what else can we build? We can build a tripwire. Okay, that's good. That's helpful. We can build this. Someone is trying to take it. Oh shit, someone tried to shoot us. Jesus Christ. Why are they shooting us? Oh shit, I walked through the tripwire, did I? Trap kill. Oh, the guy opened the trap and we killed him. Oh my god, okay, we killed someone. Okay, I need to get near this fire thing though, because I'm trying to get my heat back up real quick. Okay, well, we got a bit of healing for that, which is nice. So when you get kills, it actually kills you a bit. Which is good. We got our trap still there. Got some arrows. Speed up drone deployed. Oh, the director gave us some speed. Oh, I need some healing. Do you have any healing? <laughs> I'm so low. Oh man, we are so low on life though. Holy shit. Electronic is available. Knock him away. We can. I'm gonna try and jump down and get this thing while our turret protects us. Southeast Come on, turret. Do your work. Okay, we got a health pack. That's good. That's actually something we need. We can hear him typing. Or moving around. Oh, we missed. Look at our tower just shooting at people from up there. Okay, where's he? Oh, we got him. I can't see anyone else. Be careful. 
Oh shit, okay, that was good. Let's pick up some arrows. We need these arrows for later. Oh shit, someone's up there. Oh, he's so low as well. Okay. Oh, we got him! We did it! GG. Oh. Okay, we might have got a bit too much help from the director. <laughs> Holy shit, we won. A new electronic we got free killed, I think, overall. Which isn't too bad. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you want to see more of this game, um, feel free to comment. Uh, I want to have a go as the director as well, so if you want to see that, uh, just ask and I'll put up some videos as the director because I haven't had a go of that yet. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time.